off to Paris, everyone. Where are you? Having an espresso and biscotti. What? There's an adventure to be adventured. I have to eat. And how often do I get to Paris? I gotta take in the culture. Can you at least gulp the coffee and not slurp? It's adventure time! Come on, Zoe! We're here to go adventuring, adventuring. Red lights will show the art of the master. <laughs> Red lights. Sounds logical. We are in Paris, right? What do you mean? Red lights. Paris? Doesn't ring a bell. Forget it. So? Red lights. I see four lamps here. If I swap the clear bulbs for red bulbs, we would get red lighting. Hurrah! Let's do it! The lights are on. They'll be too hot to remove with my hands. I found the electrical control box, but it's locked. You'll need a key. There is no keyhole. It's more like a square hole. Maybe for a custom tool or a, a wrench. You might be right. I'll see what I can find to fit it. Okay, so just click on the control box, then grab these two things and open the control box. The lights are off. Really? Nice! And now we just put light bulbs into the four lights on the screen. So like there's one, there's another, there's the third, and here's the fourth. Okay, the bulbs have been swapped. That's beautiful. What do you see? Tell me, please. I'm sending you a picture. Oh, that's really nice. The man in the circle looks familiar. Yes. It's the famous picture done by Leonardo da Vinci. Ah, you're right! I think the original of the picture is here in Paris. Where? The Louvre. The Louvre! Let's go! Let's get a move on to the Louvre! Blue depth. Sky, maybe? I would say water, actually. The water is too deep and dirty. I can't see much. Okay, we can't check the bottom when the water is in. Right. Hang on, are you suggesting? We have to get rid of the water. It's the only way. Oh, jeez. There must be a service valve here somewhere. We're gonna get in so much trouble for this. It's locked. I need a key. A uh, service key. So I found a service box and unlocked it. My clever sister. To empty the fountain, we will need a valve and a handle. And a wrench. Right. Can't forget the wrench. Forgetting the wrench, why that would just be plain ridiculous. Plain ridiculous. And the final thing is here. Great. I have everything I need. Okay, I drained the water. We gotta hurry now. Check the fountain. What's this? I found a statue of the Virgin Mary. The Virgin Mary? What does this clue tell us? Hmm. How do you say Virgin Mary in French? Let me check. Oh! Notre Dame! Notre Dame? The cathedral, right? Let's go! Notre Dame! Alright, so we're going to Notre Dame, the cathedral. I believe Notre Dame means Our Lady. Uh, you know, if you want to be technical about that translation. But whatever, we're going to the famous cathedral, which is under repairs. Who is Ra? Let me check online. Rheumatoid arthritis. What? That's what's on RA.com. Please try harder. I'll call you from Notre Dame. So, any new ideas about Ra? Something more meaningful this time? I think I have it. Ra is the ancient Egyptian sun god. Pharaohs were considered to be the children of Ra. A sun god? Yep. At the highest hour, Ra will deliver you the message. What's the time there now? About noon. The highest hour! Do you see some unusual sunbeams? Not really, but the cathedral is under a reconstruction. There's a big sheet in the main window, so the sun can't shine in. Okay, so let's just knife up that, <laughs> knife up the uh, big sheet. I removed the sheet. And? The sunbeams point on one tile on the floor. So under this tile is... There is a picture of some building. I'm sending it via email. 
Okay, so what do we have here? So what is it? It's the Paris Pantheon. Aw, I, I like how whenever she takes a picture with her phone, she has to send it to him via email. She can't send it to him via text messages, because this game was made in the time when it wasn't possible to send pictures via text message. That That's cute. Who is Leon Foucault? Let me check online. So, Leon Foucault was a French physicist best known for the invention of the Foucault pendulum, a device demonstrating the effect of the Earth's rotation. The rumors say that he was a Rastacrucian. There is a big pendulum in the room. It's slowly moving. That's the Foucault pendulum for sure! That's the clue! The pendulum should show us the way. So, does it point somewhere? Points down. Hmm. We need to see the movement of the pendulum. Let's attach some brushes with paint to the pendulum! The paint should show us the pattern of the movement. Exactly! But first we need to find something for the pendulum to paint on. Alrighty, so first we're gonna find pieces of paper for our, for our pendulum. You might know the uh, symbol that the uh, Foucault pendulum makes over time. You might know it already. Maybe. I don't know. Do you? Uh, okay, I have go. four sheets paper. of paper. That should be enough. Cool. Now, try to find a brush, paint, and duct tape and apply them to the pendulum. Let's see. Just find these items and then click on the pendulum. And the final thing is a brush. I think it's somewhere around here. I don't really see anything that looks like a brush to me. Hmm. Yeah, I don't, I don't see it. Okay, hint. Yeah, it says it's somewhere around here in this square. Here? There it is. Okay, so what do we have here? It looks like a symbol of some kind. A symbol? Do you see this symbol somewhere around you? Yes, I do. I found the symbol! When I pushed it, a secret compartment opened. What's inside? There is a model of the Eiffel Tower. Eiffel Tower! Let's go! Cool! So our clue actually tells us not to go to the tower itself, but to the shadow of the tower. So we're actually gonna be pretty far away from the Eiffel Tower. That's okay, if you get too close to the Eiffel Tower, you meet up with a bunch of tourists and there's tons of people there and it's really crowded. It's, it's much better to be far away from it, right? Where to start? Can you see where the Eiffel Tower's shadow ends? So here we find various sun things and we're gonna use them over here on the upper right. gondola inside an opening. There are way too many canals in Europe. Uh, can you get more info? The book says I should ask the three saints. Okay, so find the saint statues. I believe that's Saint Patrick, Saint Sebastian, it looks like, and uh, Corona del Rio. Virgin Mary. Sounds like a village somewhere? No, it has to be something else. Let's reorder it. Is that better? Yes! This is the name of a famous canal in Venice. With the gondola, it makes sense now. Check the book. Okay, we're going to Italy, everybody. Specifically, we're going to Venice. 